guys welcome again welcome back to Android tutorial so uh, we are just create an object of the pending indent here uh, so the next step I have to we have to do is to create an object of notification manager so now I am going to create an object of notification manager class notification manager nm is equal to uh, use the method called uh, guest system service guest system service it is the notification service so it is an object so you need to cast the object here okay so we get an object of pending intent and notification manager here uh, so the next step is to get an object of notification the class called a notification so uh, notification notification is equal to new notification uh, you need to pass some argument here first one is the icon that appear on the uh, with the notification that appear on the status bar of your phone so R dot uh, I just specify an icon from drawable folder dot there is one icon called the IC launcher so I just choose that icon uh, and the next argument you need to pass is the message that appear on the screen so I just specify important I just specify a message here okay and you need to pass some uh, time miles here so I just I know I am to I am going to get the current system current time miles so just use the system dot current time miles okay so you get the pending intent object notification manager object also the notification object here uh, so the next uh, step you need to do is to specify the details of the notification so in order to do that I just create some character sequence here character sequence from is equal to I just specify some character sequence here from manager okay again another character I just specify another character sequence message is equal to mate at 5 p.m. okay I just specify a details for the notification uh, so I just create two character sequence here uh, now I have to attach this notification with the notify attach this notification uh, with the notification object so the next step is to notification dot set latest using the method called set latest event info uh, just pass an in the context object here I just pass it as this the next uh, I just uh, pass the character sequence from here also here specify the message okay uh, the next uh, argument is to the pending indent object so here it is uh, PI 
okay now we have to set some alert for the we have to set some it is a deprecated method that's why this strikes uh, now we have to setting some alert for the notification so uh, again I specify some alert here uh, notification dot I alert using the vibrate method vibrate is equal to new long so here I just specify a delay of 100 and after this delay the phone will vibrate for 250 milliseconds next again 100 minutes milliseconds delay again it will vibrate for 500 milliseconds okay uh, now I have to attach this notification to the notification manager object so uh, here the notification manager object is nm uh, nm dot notify nm dot not notify here you have to pass the notification id notification id uh, next argument is the notification notification object oh, here so here it is the notification okay so now we uh, completed all the call segments for displaying the notification okay guys that's enough for this uh, section uh, please go to the next part of this tutorial for further learning thank you for watching see you in the next part